singer wanted for ghost to ghost hookup. Ghostess is wanted for nightclub. Ghostmaster wanted to spook at banquets. Gee, I hope there's a job for me. Pardon me, my name is Casper. Do you have a job for a friendly ghost? A friendly ghost? <laughs> a friendly ghost? <laughs> somewhere else. Come on, Plunk Jump. Let's have that old cave ball. Hiya, fellas. Can I play with you? Huh? Can I? It's Skunky. Fully. Scram. Go on. Beat it. Yeah. You squirted the fresh air. <laughs> Nobody wants to play with me. <laughs> Let's go, fellas. Play ball. Okay, I'll get the ball. Here's your ball, fellas. Can I play with you? Gee, nobody wants to be my friend. Life ain't worth living without a friend.
Get them children's killing me! Listen here to me. You ain't the biggest catfish in the sea. Oh man, I got a big one. A big one. Boy, oh boy, what a fish fry this is gonna make. Confucius say, no need toothache, drive you loco. Catch black crow and chop off cocoa. Still in pot. Just like chow mein, slowly eat, now goodbye pain. Mmm, that feline's got a bad toothache. That's all I has to know. Boss, boss, I have the sole living soul what knows the secret formula for curing that toothache. And boss, if I dies, the secret dies with me. Secret? Uh, what secret? The secret of freezing the nerve, boss. Freezing the nerve? Hmm. That sounds logical. Now just stick your head into that freezing unit. Yeah? Yeah? And now we refrigerate it. Small fry. Strutting by the pool room. Here goes your toothache, boss. Oh no, you ain't 
used in space test. Why not? from outer space. Greetings. I come from the planet Mausiola. We are seeking a cat to rule over our 10 million mice. 10 million mice? By chance, are you a cat? Am I a cat? Listen, meow, meow, meow. Hmm, I believe you are. Well, the job is yours. <laughs> Your leader is ready to go, Mr. Space Mouse. Not so fast. You must first be conditioned to space travel. Okay, let's get started. Let's get started. Ten million miles. First, we start with conditioning against space dizziness. All set? Let's go. <laughs> Well, Mr. Space Mouse, uh, how did I make out? Uh, uh, pretty good, but uh, you'll need some more space tests. Now to condition you against space vacuum. Did I pass the vacuum test, Mr. Space Mouse? Did I? Operation Cold Conditioning is next. <laughs> well, that's the finish of that, cat. Am I ready to go now, Mr. Space Mouse? Oh, no! The final test is for cosmic space conditioning. Oh, boy! Ten million tender, juicy mice! Ready now. All tests satisfactory. Report for blast off at zero hour. All passengers leaving for Mouseola, please board spaceship. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, boy. Millions of miles. I can hardly wait. Prepare for countdown. Five, four, three. Everyone loves the good old summertime, the season for rambling through the park and relaxing beneath the rustling trees. At this time of year, all nature comes to life. 
But how many of us are aware of the life that goes on in a strange little world called insect land? Let's visit this fascinating place and take a close look at some of its inhabitants. Here's one that we're all familiar with, the dragonfly. This buzzy little fellow is the horsefly. The most nimble of all insects is the grasshopper, a tiny creature that can jump 20 or 30 times its own height. Wherever buggy-woogie music is played, we're sure to find a group of lively jitterbugs. The flea, a dog's pest friend, is a little fellow with a big appetite. Hmm, white meat. <laughs> a pest we all detest is the moth. The dead-end kid of the insect world is the mosquito. Oh, he broke me with a beak! He broke me with a beak! Oh. Pleasant little fellow is the bright and flashing glowworm. Would you folks like to go to a glowworm party? Well, let's glow. Happy birthday, Junior. And here is your birthday surprise. The most dangerous of all insects is the black widow spider, whose kiss means sudden death. Kiss me, big boy.